today's SoCal Spotlight, we are exploring Laguna Beach. That's right. This hidden gem nestled between seven miles of hidden coves and majestic canyons. KCAL News reporter Shima Turk is live in Laguna Beach with something perfect for all art lovers. Shima, I saw something gorgeous behind you in the tease. Can you buy it for me? <laughs> You know what? I will do that for you, friend, because we're such good friends. I'm going to have to do a GoFundMe to get it, though. These pieces are absolutely gorgeous. Laguna Beach is gorgeous, and I had no idea that so much of the history of this city is built in the arts. Sharvi Higuchi is with Festival of Arts. It's one of the special art experiences here in Laguna Beach. Tell us what it's all about, Sharvi. Well, first of all, welcome. We're so glad you're here. And look around. Look at all this artists and all the creativity. Well, we have about 120 artists' work that is being showcased here. Every medium you can possibly imagine, from oil painting, woodwork, jewelry, and so much more. And you know what? It's not just all about the artists. We have art activities that our um, patrons can participate in. In fact, we have a little project over oh, here. Oh, awesome. So no experience. You just jump in and get to take part. You can just jump in, take part, and then at, in the evening, we have incredible entertainment, music, and I suggest bringing a picnic, a bottle of wine, enjoy the music, make some art, and go visit our artists. Wow. And understand that it is very hard for the artist to be chosen for this. It is. It's actually a Journey Fine Art Show, so it's a real honor to get accepted into the Festival of Arts. And believe it or not, we've been doing this for 91 years. Wow. So what are the ladies doing here? They are doing raku pot painting. And so what they're doing is going to paint the pot, and then it's going to be um, fired, and then it's going to look something like this at the end. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, you have to try it. Hey, would you like to meet one of our artists? Let's do that. Let's go meet Elizabeth. <laughs> And you said uh, more 120 artists 120 included artists. in the show. One of them is Elizabeth McGee. Thank you so much for being with us this morning. What are you working on? Oh, I'm working on one of my still life paintings. I love using symbolism. So this is oil on wood panel. Mm -hmm. And so I like painting puns. I figure not all art has to be serious. So this one will be called Corny. So oh, this popcorn, is so farmer, cute. yeah, candy corn. So it's fun to use objects of nostalgia for painting. But I graduated from Laguna College of Art and Design. Nice. I moved here to go to that art school. When I graduated, I thought, I'll apply for Festival of Arts. It's a long shot because it's a prestigious show. Right. So I'm honored to be here. And this is my 12th summer. So. Amazing. Well, congratulations to you. That is a huge deal. How long does it take you to finish a piece like this? About a month. So wow. having to do all of the detail, um, coming up with the ideas, and then a lot of the objects that I paint, I rescue from thrift shops or yard sales and get to immortalize them as paintings. They are absolutely beautiful. Elizabeth, thank you for showing us some of your work. Guys, we're going to continue to show some of the amazing art experiences here in Laguna. We're headed to Pageant of the Masters next. You might not know what that is. Don't worry. I'm going to tell you all about it coming up. Okay, Shiba, thank you. I think the only thing better than seeing all that art is meeting the artists behind mm, totally. it and, and hearing their stories. Right. Amazing.